Hi booktube, I'm here today with a review of Mall Lockdown. Uh, it's a Star Wars novel that takes place outside of the movies. Um, it occurs before the uh, first um, movie happens. Um, and I mean Star Wars Episode 1, not Episode 4. Because um, as you can see, the main character on here is Darth Maul. And there's this beautiful, gorgeous picture of him on the back too here. Appreciate the beauty! Um, so Darth Maul is my favorite Star Wars character. Um, he is this very uh, interesting character. Um, this is the first time I've read a Star Wars novel um, and it was not disappointing at all. Um, so this is by Joe Schreiber. Um, he's well known for his horror novels. Um, but and he's also delved into um, writing about Star Wars. Um, so this book is basically Darth Maul is pit into this prison by Darth Sidious to look for this character. Um, but it's not just an ordinary prison. Um, what is expected of the prisoners is that um, they have to. F Sirens will go off, they have to go to their cells, the cells will be kind of be rearranged, and then they have to fight to the death. Um, but there's a lot more going on in this prison than just that. Um, I'm going to set it down because it is a hardcover book and it's kind of heavy. Um, or I can just set it, I don't know, up here and you can still stare at how pretty Darth Maul is. Or not! Um, anyways. Um, so I really liked the characterization of Maul. He doesn't disappoint. He is just ruthless. Um, you know, you, there's points where you want him to redeem himself and do something differently. Because I think that's kind of, like, human nature. You want the bad guys to have a reason for being bad and to actually be able to be good. Um, but Darth Maul isn't. Darth Maul is evil for the sake of being evil. Um, and I think that's really fun to read because you get to indulge in that kind of side of yourself where you just, you kind of want to do something bad, not for any particular reason, but just because it's bad. Um, <laughs> I really like that, enjoying that um, aspect and the, 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 the fights, the way they're described and how he goes about destroying his enemies and how he does it. It's gruesome and it's, it's really entertaining. Um, yes, um... What else is there to say? The the writing's, you know, good. The um, the characters are all interesting. Uh, he doesn't inundate you with too many, um, but there is a good cast there. And you get to know a little bit about all of them. And um, you get Jabba the Hutt before he's, you know, Jabba the Hutt. Um, you know, when he's just starting out and everything. And I really liked seeing him become a, a major character, I guess. Darth Maul's kind of villain, one of the many that he's fighting against. Um, I do want to talk about this one creature from the from the novel. Um, I don't know if you remember um, the Cyrax, the giant worm <laughs> from the Star Wars movies. Anyways, there's one in this kind of prison spaceship thing and it's... I think he really does expand on that creature and what it, it does and makes it really terrifying. Um, so what he does is he has the Cyrox um, consume people, like eat them, um, swallow them, whatever, but then their minds become part of this hive mind. Um, and, um, you know, because he's eating all these bad guys who are in this, in this prison, um, and they're all kind of kind of screaming for help and oh you know this and that and and then all of a sudden it's like feed I must eat I must feed and like everything goes and it's if you get close enough to the worm you can hear it and I thought that was really terrifying to you know you're not you're physically not there but you're you're mentally like your soul or or whatever is there and it's part of this this worm's mind and I just thought it was so like intriguing I wanted to read more about you know this 
giant worm. Um, yes. So, <laughs> I mean, that's um, this Darth Maul, wherever it went, Darth Maul novel, Maul Lockdown by Joe Schreiber. Um, I'd say definitely if you're into the Star Wars universe at all, this is a great read. Um, it really um, sticks to um, canon, um, what with um, Darth Sidious, um, the Emperor Palpatine, and, and all that kind of jazz that goes on, you know, in the movies, in the, in the scenes, you get a little bit more explanation in the books. Um, so I definitely look forward to picking up more Star Wars novels. Now that I know that they're this freaking cool, um, yes. So let me know if you've read any uh, Star Wars novels or what you think of um, expanded universes, I guess, within different fandoms and everything. And remember to keep on reading. Hey, you might want to check out Pickle's Instagram Twitter, Goodreads, and other social media links in the description bar underneath.